Okay, if it's up there, you've stolen the points. Broken ground zero. And it's a game. Okay. Show me Dick Cheney. <laughs> number four. What's number four? Dick Nixon. Yeah, Dick Nixon too. And number six. at 173, the calls at 130. It's still anybody's game. Don't go away. This is Dick Card telling you to stay right where you are. Closed captioning is sponsored in part by... Welcome back to the Family Feud. The Angle Hearts at 173. The McCall's at 130. Carol, Jim... All right, shake his hand. I'm tripling the points, okay? All right. Now, for this question, I'm only going to read it once. I'm only reading it once, so Larry, pay attention. Everybody over there. Top four answers on the board. Name an occupation in which people have a chance to become famous. Jim. Actor. Good answer. Good answer. Actor. Good answer. Player yeah. pass. Oh, he's playing. He's not telling me, but he's playing. <laughs> Good answer. That's all right. Okay, how about a uh, singer? A singer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. rock star. Yeah. Rock star. Yeah. 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 Singer. Yeah. Especially with your lyrics. I know. Yeah. That's right, Bob. Okay, I'll go with uh, actress. <laughs> okay, uh, librarian. <laughs> I tell you what, they should be famous. <laughs> Keepers of the books. Marion, Madam Librarian. Oh. All right, Randy. Well, you know, mine's not such as elaborate as his, but I'd say like a sports. Somebody yeah, a sports, sports guy. guy. Good answer. A sports figure. Steve. Uh, artist. Oh, right. Artist. Oh, yeah. Good answer. All right. Good answer. If artist is up there, you've, you've taken the board, you've taken the points, and the game. If not, it's your second strike. Artist. Oh. There's one more up there, Jim, and you have two strikes. Okay. No pressure, but this is kind of for the game, because they get a chance to steal, and there's five heads over there thinking about it. Hireman. <laughs> Good answer. Fireman. Good answer. Good answer. You know, that's okay because they were the heroes. When things happen, sometimes they're the first ones there. If it's there, you guys have won the game. If not, the McCalls get a chance to steal. Fireman. I think a lot of politicians are famous. So I'm going to go with politicians. A politician. Okay. All right. Actually, actor's already up there, so... Uh, oh, wait. Wait, politician's different. It's very different. They write their own material. No, wait a minute. They, well, there's something different. We don't know what it is. But if it's up there, you guys have taken the points away from our champions of four days. Get the points, and you won the game. Show me politician. We'll be back to play Fast Money right after this. Don't go away. Wow. Yeah. The McCall family won the game. It's time to play Fast Money in a shot at $20,000. Yeah. Right. This is off stage, but you can't see or hear your answer. I'll ask you five questions in 20 seconds. Try to give me the most popular answer. If you can't think of something, say pass, and we'll come back to it if there's time left. Now, if you and Marissa together get 200 points, you'll win $20,000. That's right. Are you ready? 20 seconds on the clock, please. 
clock will start after I read the first question. Tell me the hour of day when a grocery store is busiest. Six o'clock in the evening. Name a cartoon character with big ears. Bugs Bunny. Name a food they serve at the circus. Popcorn. Name something bees do. Make honey. Name something you bought that you can't afford. My car. <laughs> All right. Let's see how you're doing. <laughs> good answers. Very good. The hour of the day that the grocery store is busiest. You said 6 p.m. Everybody's buying dinner. Survey said 20. <laughs> On the board. A cartoon character with big ears. You said eh, Bugs Bunny. Survey said <laughs> That's the way to go. A food that they serve at the circus. You said popcorn. Survey said <laughs> Boy, you're hitting them. You're hitting good. Something that bees do. You said make honey. Survey said Wow. <laughs> Name something you bought that you can't afford. You said your car. What do you drive? Monte Carlo. Okay, survey said. David got you 176. Woo! You need 24. <laughs> All right. I'll ask you, you the same five questions. You can't duplicate the answers. Okay. If you do, you'll hear this sound. <laughs> I'll say try again. Give me another answer. Okay. It's tougher. Okay. So we're going to give you 25 seconds. All right. You ready? Yeah. Remind everyone of David's answers. <laughs> 25 seconds on the clock, please. <laughs> Time will start after I read the first question. Tell me the hour of day when a grocery store is busiest. 10 a.m. Name a cartoon character with big ears. Daffy Duck. Name a food they serve at the circus. Popcorn. Try again. Hot dogs. Name something bees do. Buzz. Name something you've bought that you can't afford. A diamond ring. <laughs> okay. Oh, boy. You need 24 points. Oh, my God. You did so good. He's done the heavy lifting. Oh, my gosh. The hour of day when a grocery store is busiest, you said... 10 a.m. Survey said? <laughs> 2. 5 p.m. Number one answer. 5 p.m. Okay. A cartoon character with big ears. You said? <laughs> Daffy Duck. Do ducks have ears? I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> so, you got big ears, do ya? <laughs> Survey said? Oh. Bugs Bunny, number one answer. A food that they ser serve at the circus. You said, hot dogs. Survey said, oh, hot and candy, number one answer. Making honey, number one answer in a car. Number one answer, $20,000 their first time out. And they're coming back tomorrow for another shot at another $20,000 right here on the Family Feud.